Time Magazine named the Silence Breakers Person of the Year for 2017. These are the women and men who shared their stories of assault, harassment, and hostility, and publicly named their alleged abusers in Hollywood, the media, and politics. But if you look closer, there's something else on the cover. A hint that there are many more who don't or can't break that silence. So, while 2017 was a landmark year for talking about sexual assault, harassment, and rape, a majority of the women and men who felt violated don't speak out at all. For every 1,000 rapes, it's estimated that only 310 are reported. That's just under one-third. In fact, it's believed that rape is the most underreported crime. Of those reported, only a fraction lead to arrest. And only a fraction of those arrests lead to prosecution. And only a fraction of those prosecuted are incarcerated. And when it comes to harassment, well, a U.S. government report found that when men and women were sexually harassed at work, the least common response was to formally report it. Only 30% of people did. That means that for every three that reported, another seven remained silent. Another study cited in that EEOC report found that of the people who reported harassment at work, 75% faced some sort of retaliation for doing so which explains why so few people report their harassment. Fear. In fact, fear is the number one reason people don't report. Fear of retaliation for speaking out. And this is why the silence breakers are a big deal. 2017 certainly feels like a year in which many, many more people are speaking up in spite of that fear. But there's just so much more we don't know. Even the statistics cited in this video, by their own admission, overrepresent the experiences of straight white women and probably don't accurately reflect the experiences of women of color, men, lesbians, gays, or transgender people. Which is to say that the stories of the few silence breakers that have come forward are really just the tip of the elbow for all the people remaining silent.